Bienvenidos, worldwide fans of the planet's hottest entertainment with an edge. Jaime and Fuego here, and I welcome you once more to my namesake program in Fuego Tainment. And as you can see, we're in kind of the barren little office that has been commandeered by a treadmill in the midst of the pandemic. So uh, I am going to do my best to accommodate all of you and give my thoughts on Borat 2, which has legit dropped the first trailer, the first official trailer. It's like three minutes. And the the title is absolutely insane so uh okay deep breath as they're saying here on the collider article borat subsequent movie film delivery of prodigious bribe to american regiment for make benefit once glorious nation of kazakhstan so they obviously changed the title which uh <laughs> referenced Mike Pence previously and so on and so forth. So, I mean, that one was funny. It was like pornographic monkey, all of this craziness. But legit, I have uh, gone on record a few times to say that I think the funniest scene in cinematic history, contrary to my father who thinks the funniest scene in cinematic history is where uh, Jeff Daniels gets stuck with the uh, malfunctioning toilet in Dumb and Dumber, I have gone on record to say I think the funniest scene in cinematic history is Borat's naked wrestling with the fat guy in the original Borat film. My God, I literally nearly pissed myself the first time I saw it, and I'm in tears every time I do thereafter. So let's see what is up with this sequel, which uh, is coming October 23rd, apparently. Uh, it was filmed right after the, the just COVID restrictions started to get a little bit more like film friendly, I guess, as far as just allowing people to try to make stuff and be creative. It's been a crazy year, guys. So maybe such a bit of Cohen can add some humor and enjoyment. This is going to be on Prime Video October 23rd, but let's see what this wacky trailer is all about. Special announcement, Kazakhstan Ministry of Information. <laughs> and lots of tourism as well, which is what was funny. So lots of recycled footage so far. Uh, this is great. The fact that people will be able to recognize him and it's going to play into the story, obviously. <laughs> Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Yeah, the hairy pits and everything. Oh my lord, no. <laughs> this one with the baby on it. <laughs> <laughs> can you take it off? No, we can't. Can you take it off? No, no, we cannot. That's not what we do. Oh, his disguise. Oh, my God. Did you ever put one in your mouth? Oh, my Lord. Where is everybody? So they don't spread this virus. Could I stay in your home? I never quarantine. I never am. Oh my lord. Oh my god. I... <laughs> Oh no, there's Pence. There is Pensy. <laughs> is he gonna... Oh my god! <laughs> oh, you look so confused! Movie film, October 23rd! <laughs> Under the age of three? Okay, 
Well, uh, if there is any worries about a dip of quality, I don't even feel like I could potentially play this trailer back because I would probably be uh, needing to change my drawers here or something. But oh my god, I love it. This is honestly the exact film that we need right now after having such a craptastic 2020. Thank you. Gracias. A grande gracias, as I like to say on this silly channel. Such a better Cohen. My lord in heaven, this was ingenious on your part, <laughs> what he's lampooning from, I mean, hey, I'm a registered independent, so I'm not here to laugh about, you know, just extreme right or left or whatever, but I, I mean, funny is funny and ignorant is ignorant, and <laughs> he's obviously going to just <laughs> dial right in on all of that stuff, and the, the, the disguises are what is going to make this so insanely amusing the fact that he's playing into the fact that people will recognize him the fact that i mean he was out on the streets actually doing this interacting with real people that's what made the original one so brilliant it's what unfortunately made uh bruno and uh the dictator not as good at least in my opinion but borat the original is legit one of the funniest films ever made i am beyond belief excited stoked as all hell for this film um yeah i mean he's Dressing as, he's dressing as Cheeto. I can't believe it. Um, my God. Anyway, uh, that's going to be the extent of my thoughts, guys. What did you think of the Borat 2 trailer? Uh, let's just give that title one more thing. Borat's subsequent movie film, delivering a prodigious bribe to American regime for make benefit once glorious nation of Kazakhstan. I cannot wait. Holy shit. What did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And I extend the grande gracias. I've been Jaime in Fuego. And you can find more on all social media sectors like Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, here on YouTube. A like, a share, a subscribe. Help me get to that point where I can monetize this channel, for God's sake, and do a proper live show. That would be wondrous on your parts. But uh, if you like spectacular stuff, jump over to youtube.com slash the horror show channel. That is the bigger uh, just entity that I am associated with and a proud co-producer and host on along with my dude Cecil Laird, the creator and the showrunner over there, and our ladies, Marsha Parker, um, Susie Von Slata, obviously, Robert Duell, Drew, the whole gang over there. We appreciate y'all if you like scarific stuff. Here in October, I'm about to drop a review of Antebellum later today, and also my thoughts on that uh, rather peculiar South Park episode last night that was uh, as hit and miss as could be. But hey, uh, I appreciate all of you, and until the real of Kyle comes around once more, hasta luego, amigos, constant readers, viewers alike, say thank you, I appreciate the hell out of you, and I hope we share more of this film palaver sooner rather than later. And until then, uh, be very nice to each other, yes, it's good.